My name is Papa Joe Bradford. I'm the CEO and founder of Elijah's Heart. This is my beautiful wife, Denise Bradford. And just so you know, it was her idea to start all of this stuff. It's a 501c3 nonprofit, and we have basically three main programs where we help at-risk children and their families. Uh, the first one we call the Walk of Love. And basically, we take food and personal care products to entire communities. And uh, we have volunteers come out. We have volunteers from churches, businesses, all types of organizations. And we basically go out and show love in action. And another program that we have is we basically teach a child to fish. It's a literacy program. Kids really need to learn how to read in our country. And we call it Kids Love to Read. And we have another program called Unity Impact. And basically, that's our music and arts program. Uh, we have choir, drama, dance, and we, basically, we want to teach these kids, you know, to, to express themselves, you know, through the arts. And those are our three main programs, and uh, we love it when we have volunteers, contributors that help us uh, in this mission. You can find us at Elijah'sHeart.com. It's spelled E-L-I-J-A-H-S-H-E-A-R-T.com. We really appreciate Darrell Waltrip and the Hometown Hero Program, and uh, I really honor him for what he's done with his, with his life, uh, what he did in racing, and what he's doing now to help the community. And so it's a great honor to win this award, and even greater honor to be able to call Darrell Waltrip my friend now. Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Hometown Heroes. Uh, we're at the uh, Darrell Waltrip Subaru Volvo store this morning and we have a special guest another one of our hometown heroes and Papa Joe now look I know they made movies about you and that's a big deal unconditional but listen you're getting ready to receive an award that will put that one to shame this is a hometown hero we do this uh, this is our 55th 56th one of these that we've done and we we go out in the community, we have all these folks that go out in the community and they make recommendations for someone that they think we should honor. And uh, this young man over here, right here, uh, he nominated you. And So why don't you tell us uh, a little bit about Papa Joe and why you thought he'd be a great hometown hero? Well, the um, reason why I thought he would be a great hometown hero, one of the big things about Papa Joe, he has a big heart. Heart for community, a heart for others. Uh, I've never really seen someone as passionate as uh, seeing about the needs of others. And um, he's just a caring man. Him and his wife, Denise, uh, they're beautiful people. And I really couldn't think of, of there, uh, there would be a better choice for this award. So uh, we're glad to nominate him and glad to see him receive this award. Great. All right, well, now to the, uh, the reason why you're here this morning. I, like I told you, I'm the trophy guy. Okay. So, because I love trophies, I'm a, I'm a, I got, I got a few of them here and there, but I love trophies, and this is one of my favorites. And we want to present you with this trophy and uh, in honor of you being here this morning. And then John's the money guy, and uh, check for five hundred dollars for a, whatever your favorite charity is. What do you think that possibly would be your favorite charity? Oh no, I think she'll help me out with that. <laughs> All right, and you brought a lot of your friends with you this morning and all the beautiful smiling faces. Thank all of you for being here this morning. And uh, let's give Papa Joe a big hand. Wait a second. 